Alex, hurry up! The new episode of Pen Spin Story has been released. I can't, Lance. Go and watch it without me. Someone is wrong on the internet and I'm going to show him who is the boss. I need to change the mind of Randy from the... Uh... Internets. Do we need new names for old hybrids and tricks? Or we just need to get rid of extra names and replace them with breakdowns? For example, instead of double charge 2312, we can write down... This is double charge 2312. We can write down Twisted Sonic 2312, Warped Sonic 1223. Some may and will confront that and have already done that in our Discord server, but I insist we need new names for old hybrids and linkages. Hello, you're on Penstock, channel about pen spinning. My name is Alex Sukhov and today I want to start a little discussion which you can take part in in the comment section under this video on YouTube or join our Discord server and continue to argue in there or better on Reddit. There you also can show off your skills and ask questions if you have some problems. Recently in our Discord server came Isaac, you know Isaac. Everybody knows Isaac, probably the oldest pen spinner so far nowadays, among active ones. So he came to our Discord server and started to make fun of my tournament Spinball Cup 2019, which has ended a couple of weeks ago. After that he began to f make fun of my tutorial video on uh, Spider Sonic, which looks like this. I don't remember how exactly he told, but the point was that I made the name for a hybrid with no reason. He suggested to replace the name Spider Sonic with um, this linkage Sonic 231314. A lot of guys supported him <laughs> on Discord server because it is I suck, for God's sake, how can he be wrong? Let me make it clear how I think he is wrong from my point of view at least, because you know that this is my opinion, you don't have to agree with that and you don't have to agree with any other opinions, just Pick up what you think is closer to you. But for me, writing down names and giving new names for all four linkages is much more convenient and much more comfortable to read and to write breakdowns. Okay, double charge is pretty understandable, it is pretty easy to break down, but what about Demon Sonic? It is low intermediate trick, I'd say it is a little bit higher than a beginner trick. But it looks like this. It is a hybrid between Sonic 3423 to Pass 2312. And if I see this hybrid, this breakdown, I would be a little bit confused, because it would look something like this for me. And as for Demon Sonic, yes, without tutorials it would be pretty hard for me, for example, to learn this trick. And I don't think that I will ever find out the tutorial for linkage Sonic 3.4 Pass 2.3.1.2. Nobody writes breakdowns in the names of uh, YouTube tutorial videos. But that's about Demon Sonic, it is pretty simple. But what about Spider Sonic, which is much more complicated and it is intermediate trick, at least. How can I learn it without a detailed tutorial? For me it is pretty difficult to watch some videos, watch them in slow motion and repeat after guys, without any notifications about how exactly and what are hard points at this trick, what I should pay attention on. I'm pretty sure that subscribers of this channel, you guys, have also some problems with that, because um, otherwise why would you <laughs> subscribe? Because I made this channel to show you a detailed explanation of different elements in pen spinning. So if we break down Spider Sonic to Sonic 231314 and write it down, there is no guarantee that we will ever find any tutorial according to this note. So you see this? and you try to make it, you see that you can't make it, you watch video in slow motion, you can't repeat after the guy. And many times I hear from people that you should learn pen spinning like that, but for me it is impossible. I need to see detailed explanation, I need to see breakdown in front of me. Otherwise it is really hard for me to understand what is going on in the video. And I need a breakdown to be as clear as it is possible. So I asked 
a few guys, the most loud ones, who supported I suck very loudly. I asked them to repeat this linkage, the second part, Sonic 1.3 to 1.4, and this is what happened. Yes, this execution shows us exactly this linkage, but it has nothing to do with Spider Sonic, which looks like this. Completely another trick. So it seems that Guru of Pin Spinning, who participated in making rules for writing breakdowns, made a breakdown which can't be read correctly. So even if Pen spinners will make video tutorials and name them after linkages, there is no guarantee they will uh, name it correctly. For example, it has more to do with Sonic Moonwalk rather than just Sonic, because Sonic goes up, Sonic Moonwalk goes down. But it is not a Sonic Moonwalk also, it is something, I guess, between Sonic Moonwalk and Sonic Clip, but none of them either. That's why I made a name for this trick. And some people went a little bit more forward, told that we actually don't really need uh, most of the names of the tricks. And I think with this kind of logic we are going to end up with um, writing breakdowns like Sonic 2312 in front of middle finger with 1.5 revolution. Or we just can write Twisted Sonic 2312. Let me know what you think about this meta, because I think it deserves a discussion. Because writing breakdowns correctly is very important to make our community and our hobby grow, to establish correct rules, to make them as clear as it is possible. See you in the next video tutorial, may the style be with you. Bye.